Welcome to the HUD Environment Review Online System eTutorial. This is one in a series of video tutorials on completing an environmental review through HEROES. When completing an environmental assessment, you must complete several screens not required for other levels of review. This video will show you how to complete these screens. After completing the initial and project summary screens, you will be directed to screen 1366 Project Justification to explain the needs and conditions that necessitate this project. Respond to these questions and press Save and Continue. Following screen 2005, Related Laws and Authorities, you must evaluate the impact of the project on a variety of factors and describe mitigation measures as appropriate. Screen 4010 Environmental Assessment Factors is made up of four columns, Environmental Assessment Factors, Impact Code, Impact Evaluation, and Mitigation. The Environmental Assessment Factor column is comprised of topics grouped under Land Development, Socioeconomic, Community Facilities and Services, and Natural Features. Information for the Environmental Assessment Factors can be found on the One CPD Resource Exchange website. In the next column, select the impact code that best documents the impact the activity will have on each factor. Select Impact Code 1 if all impacts are anticipated to be minor and beneficial. Code 2 if no impacts are anticipated. Code 3 if minor adverse impacts may occur and mitigation may be required and code 4 if significant or potentially significant impacts are anticipated. Under Impact Evaluation, describe the impact the project will have for each factor. This evaluation should include a summary of all reviews, consultations, permits, or other approvals related to each factor. For some factors, you should consider the impact the project will have on the factor and for others, discuss the impact the factor will have on the project. Describe any necessary mitigation measures, including a timeline for completion, in the mitigation column on the right side of the screen. At the bottom of screen 4010, you have the option to upload supporting documentation by clicking the Upload File button. To continue to the next screen, click Save and Continue. Please note, you can move freely between screen 2005 and screens 4010 while working on your environmental assessment. On screen 4100, Environmental Assessment Analysis, you must describe the cumulative impact the project will have on the surrounding environment, potential alternatives that were considered, and other analysis. Provide detailed responses for the questions on the screen including documentation where requested. When finished, press Save and Continue to proceed to the mitigation screen. For information on completing your environmental assessment, watch the video on completing the Environmental Review Record, EA. Thank you for your participation. This concludes the e-tutorial on environmental assessment analysis. For additional tutorials or resources, go to the 1CPD Resource Library.